Our third takeaway was about experiences. We all know quilters love to go on retreat now more than ever after being locked up for so many years, yeah. they wanna to get together. So we saw a lot of travel related products and things that were uh, designed to make that experience a better one for quilters. Mm -hmm. So I'll kick it off with All a right. couple carrying cases. Uh, Gudrun Erla had the carry-all quilting case and it was like a hard-sided, um, kind of like briefcase, almost like luggage yep. is now nowadays. And um, it had some flip pockets inside that would flip, but also zipped to keep your lock, your rulers secure. And then there was also a hanging clip, which I thought was great. Like yep. you could hang it if you were not traveling and right. in your sewing room and just wanted to store them on a closet hook or a hanger. Right, and there was room in there to put a cutting mat mm -hmm. and some fabric if you wanted to. So really it eliminated the corners breaking on your rulers or your mat getting warped out of shape or trying to squeeze it into a suitcase where it really doesn't fit. It's right. made for quilting supplies. Yeah, and you know, sometimes when I go to retreat, I bring way too many bags, but just think I could put a project or many in that and That's right. be on the go. That's yeah. right. We also found a company uh, called TQM who's making a folding 6 by 24 inch ruler that folds at the 12 inch mark, so folds in half. So if you're trying to tuck a ruler into your bag or your suitcase, but you're trying not to bend the things or have it coming out the end where it scratches up your arms or your car, um, it was perfect for that. Yeah. Another thing that you could use for your retreat or for your home is um, the By Annie ruler wrap pattern. It was similar to Gudrun's, but it was, you know, a soft case and it rolled up into kind of a tube. So for easy storage, you could store it on the bottom shelf of your sewing unit or, um, you know, put it in a closet, but it kind of tuck it away very easily. Right. And I think like the if you were more of a car traveler and weren't worried about being on an airline or, mm -hmm. or that kind of thing or a long trip, it would be great because you could just roll it up, tuck it into your trunk and take it with you and a way to store your uh, rulers in your sewing room. I also liked, this isn't necessarily a new product, but it was kind of a new thinking for me. Um, Clover has the domed threaded needle case where it has room for probably uh, eight needles that you thread ahead of time. So if you've ever been on the car drive where you're doing the uh, stop bouncing so I can thread my needle kind of thing and you want to bind a quilt when you're on the road or you're going on an airplane trip, you can thread all your needles ahead of time. It has a little mechanism where you can wind it on and put the lid on it and then you can just pull out one of your needles at a time yeah, and you're ready to go. Nifty stuff. Yep. And then also the Aliso um, mini case. So yep. I have an Aliso iron. I love it but um, I wonder where to put the cord. Like I wrap it up and try to tuck it in. Well, there is a case that is um, felt and it has a zipper back so you can slide it in from the back and then a cute little um, two handles for a cute little carrying case. Right. Like I really liked it. And then the Aliso Pro is also new yep. at this market. So all fun stuff, all designed to make the quilters experience better. And we're all about having a great experience. Yeah.